Hello and welcome back. So in our last video I served my project and what is displaying is WA works. So let's see where is this coming from. So if we come to our index.html we notice uh, it's pretty much like a regular HTML uh, document. We have the HTML tags, our head, uh, our links, uh, some meta. Uh, so this is going this means that this is going to scale well for uh, devices. And as you can see, we have our WA root tag. You remember when I showed you that I created um, a different prefix? This is why. Uh, if it was default, this would be app.root. App, uh, uh, so where is this app.root uh, coming from? So we're going to go to our source folder and inside there our app folder which is where we're going to be uh, mainly working at and as you can see in my app.component.ts ts is short for typescript i have uh, all of this so what does this mean uh, component is part of angular core this is going to be the here automatically thanks to our cli and we have our selector wa root and the selector is oh sorry the selector is this uh, our html tag and then we have a uh, template url app.component.html so if we open that like i have here i have an h1 that has a uh, string interpolation uh, that is a form of data binding of title and what does title have is wa works we also have an array uh, that goes into the property of the style url style urls because you can have more than one style here you can have app, com app component 2.css and we'll have a different styling but that's not something i'm going to be covering right now so if I change something here for uh, something like this is a component, uh, I save it, and as you can see, it's going to automatic automatically reload uh, my browser, and it changed my message. Okay, so in future videos, I'm going to be showing you how to create new components using uh, the CLI. And the first one we're going to create is the header that is going to uh, give us uh, routing. Actually, I'm going to create three components, the header and kind of like the two pages uh, that we're going to be using, uh, the current weather and the forecast. So uh, if you have more questions, uh, please leave a comment uh, or subscribe. If not, I'll see you in the next video. Ciao.